Yesterday, we celebrated the Feast of All Saints. In Old English, All Hallows, from which we have Halloween, the evening or eve of All Saints. The saints we think about today include not only all canonised or well-known saints, but also all who are praising God in heaven. These include members of our own family and friends whom we have loved. The way of the cross is the way of love, lived by all the saints, and so we begin in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. The Beatitudes are Jesus' special teaching showing us genuine values. He said, Happy are those who are poor in spirit. God will give them the kingdom. Happy are those who mourn. God will comfort them. Happy are those who are gentle. God will give them what he promised. Happy are those who really desire to do what God wants. God will satisfy them fully. Happy are those who are merciful to others. God will be merciful to them. Happy are the pure in heart. God will show himself to them. Happy are those who work for peace. God will call them his children. Happy are those who suffer because they do what God wants. God will give them the kingdom. We all have our heroes, people we admire or that we'd like to be like. Those who achieve much in sport and music have to train and practice a lot. The saints had their own training, which is the Beatitudes, the special way that Jesus taught. And if we all try to be like that, there would be much less pain in the world. Imagine if everyone was modest in spirit, sorry for all evils, gentle, doing what God wants, merciful and working for peace. That is a better way than so much of the hatred, violence, war and crime that we so often see on TV. The saints put God and others first in their lives and so they made a huge contribution to the society in which they lived. Yes, it would be lovely to be a sporting hero or a great musician, but the world would be a better place if we were all saints in the little things in life. Is there some saint that you think is particularly nice? What would you have to be to be more like your favourite saint or your patron? Quietly say a little prayer to some saint or to somebody good who has died. The response to the prayers is, Saints of God, come to our help. God of all peoples, we pray with your saints that the lives of the saints may spur others to follow Christ. Saints of God, come to our help. That the courage of the saints may strengthen others who are suffering. Saints of God, come to our help. That the prayers of the saints may help priests to be holy and dedicated. Saints of God, come to our help. That the church may learn from the saints how to walk with the poor. Saints of God, come to our help. That we may look at the saints in order to know how to live. Saints of God, come to our help. May the Lord bless and take care of you. May the Lord be kind and gracious to you. 
May the Lord look on you with favour and give you peace. Amen. This week, children, you are going to be writing some prayers of intention. And we will make sure that those prayers are blessed by Father. Let's make the sign of the cross together. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.